Yo, what up? This is going to be a short video that's going to show you how to sample vinyl into Koala Sampler. First thing you want to do is make sure that you have Koala Sampler set to monitor in, which is going to be blue. Second, you want to check your settings. Now we have, by default, the record set to hold to record, meaning that if, as long as you hold down the button, it's going to record. I like to have it hands-free to where I can just hit the, the button and it's going to be in record mode. So I would set that to off which is grayed out so when I queue up my record I can hit the record button and it's in record mode and I can select where I want to record on the, on the vinyl record and then turn it off and it's still recording now if you hit have that set to hold to record you, as long as you're holding it down, that's going to be where it's going to record at, which is an option too. Next thing, you want to go to edit, and then it's going to give you the options on how to chop it. You go to tools, and then you go to auto chop if you want to chop it that way. Now you have three options on chopping, transient, equal, and lazy. And once you select the method you want to chop it in, you just hit chop. If you want to also make sure that you assign it to a choke group, that way the, ch the chops don't overlap each other. This is the original copy, and then these are the chops right there. Hope that helps out for anybody that has trouble chopping vinyl. It's a quick and easy method. Uh, probably the fastest method I've found to chop samples of any uh, piece of software I've ever used. So if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below or hit me up. Peace. Also, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Pass on the information to anybody that might be interested. And even if there aren't, you know, help a brother out with some subs. Just saying. I'm just playing. Peace out, though.